Google Cloud Platform GCP is a powerful cloud computing platform offered by Google that provides a wide range of services for building. Deploying and managing applications and infrastructure. Whether you're a developer, an IT professional, or a business owner, GCP offers a flexible and scalable solution to meet your cloud computing needs. In this guide, we'll walk you through the essential steps to get started with GCP. One, sign up for GCP. To begin your journey with GCP, you need to sign up. For an account, visit the GCP website and click on the Get Started for Free button. You'll need to provide billing information, but Google offers a free tier with a certain amount of credits to get you started. To navigate the GCP console, if you're signing up, you'll access the GCP console, which is the web-based interface for managing your GCP resources. Take some time to explore the console and get familiar. With its layout, it's where you'll create, configure, and monitor your services and resources. Three, project setup. Organize your work within GCP by creating projects. Projects are containers for your GCP resources. You can create a new project from the GCP console. Give it a meaningful name and ID to help you identify its purpose. Four, understand GCP services. GCP offers a vast array of services, including Compute Engine, Kubernetes Engine, Cloud Storage, Biggery, and many more. Familiarize yourself with the services available and their use cases Google provides. Extensive documentation and tutorials for each service. Five, billing and cost management. Keep an eye on your billing and cost management. GCP provides tools to help you understand your usage and expenses. Set up budget. Alerts to avoid unexpected charges. Six, identity and access management IM. Security is crucial. IAM allows you to control who has access to your GCP resources and what actions they can perform. Define roles and permissions for users, groups, and service accounts. Seven, virtual machines with Compute Engine. One of the fundamental services in GCP is Compute Engine, which allows you to create and manage virtual machines vMiz. Use Compute Engine to deploy applications, run workloads, and manage instances. Aid Container Orchestration with Kubernetes Engine. If you're into containerization, offers Kubernetes Engine, which simplifies the management of containerized applications. Learn about pods, deployments, and services in Kubernetes. Nine storage options. GCP offers various storage solutions, including cloud. Storage for object storage, Cloud SQL for managed databases.
and Bigtable for an OSQL databases. Choose the appropriate storage service based on your application's needs. 10. Serverless Computing with Cloud Functions Experiment with serverless computing using cloud functions. These are event-driven, lightweight functions that automatically scale based on demand. Eleven. Data Analytics with Bigory Dive into Data Analytics with Bigory. It's a fully managed, serverless data warehouse that allows you to analyze massive data sets using SQL-like queries. 12. Networking and Load Balancing Learn about GCP's networking capabilities, including virtual private cloud VPC setup, firewall rules, and load balancing to ensure your applications are highly available and secure. 13. Monitoring and Logging Use Stackdriver now part of Google Cloud's operations. Suite for monitoring and logging. It provides insights into the performance and health of your applications. 14. Deployment and Continuous 14. Deployment and Continuous Integration, Continuous Deployment C CD, Implement CI, CD pipelines with tools like Cloud Build to automate software deployment, testing, and delivery. 15. and Auto Scaling Understand How GCP's auto scaling capabilities work to efficiently manage resources based on traffic and workload demands. Machine Learning and AI Explore GCP's Machine Learning and AI services like AI Platform and Vision AI to integrate AI capabilities into your applications. 15. Support and Community GCP has an active community and offers various support plans, utilize the community forums, documentation, and support resources as needed. Compliance and Security Best Practices Adhere to GCP's best practices for compliance and security to protect your data and ensure regulatory compliance. Cost Optimization Continuously optimize your GCP resources and costs by right-sizing instances using committed use contracts and exploring cost-effective storage options. 20. Stay updated. GCP is continually evolving with new features and updates. Stay informed by following GCP blogs, attending webinars, and participating in training programs. Getting started with Google. Cloud Platform can be a rewarding experience. As you gain proficiency, you'll be able to leverage GCP's vast capabilities to build, deploy, and scale applications efficiently and securely.